Hello. Next, he presented the work entitled Effect of Lignin Photo Oxidation on the Chemical and Thermal Properties of Guamachu Wood. Wood is an extraordinarily functional material and its chemical composition and hierarchical structure offer enormous possibilities for functionalization and modification to obtain biological materials with specific and complex properties. Several chromophore groups in lignin are responsible for the absorption capacity in the UV region which is highly photosensitive with a clear tendency to degrade to form free radicals when energized by photons of UV light. Likewise, the high reactivity of photoexcited chromophore radicals can contribute to an effective photocatalytic degradation process to achieve lignin bleaching. Based on the above, the purpose of this work was to evaluate the changes caused by photoxidative process of lignin through a combined treatment of hydrogen peroxide and ultraviolet light using guamache wood. Within the methodology, the changes in the functional groups of guamache wood were determined by infrared analysis. The lignin content was determined by the Tappy method and finally the thermal properties were evaluated and thermal gravimetric analysis. As results are obtained, the infrared spectra indicate the presence of the lignin structure that has high resistance to ultraviolet light. Despite the degradation of its chromophore groups, likewise an increase in the carbonyl group is observed, confirming the oxidation and discoloration of the sample. The application of the TAPI method indicates a change in the lignin content from 25.7% to 21.9%, establishing that 85% of the lignin was preserved after the photooxidative treatment of the wood. Meanwhile, the results of the thermal analysis show a reduction in the maximum degradation temperature from 351 degrees Celsius to 265 degrees Celsius. According to the results obtained, guamachil wood could be considered to be used as a protective coating in electronic devices to disperse the heat produced. Hello.